storage devices input and output devices are used to enter data and take out results but how can we see the output after some hours or days we need to store the output once we store the work it will never get lost we can see our work later even after many years we use some devices to store our work these devices are known as storage devices a computer can store our work in different storage devices some of the storage devices are hard disk cd rom dvd pen drive etc let us read about them hard disk a hard disk is the main storage device it is fixed inside the cpu it is used to store large amount of data and information it is also known as hard drive cd rom drive the full form of cd rom is compact disk read only memory a cd rom is a circular disk it is used to store data it is a portable device dvd the full form of dvd is digital video disc it is similar in shape to that of a cd but has a large storage capacity as compared to a cd one can store up to 4.7 gb of data as compared to 700 mb of data capacity of a cd pen drive at present pen drive is the most commonly used storage device it is so small that it fits in our pocket keychain etc it comes in various storage sizes like 4 gb 8 gb 16 gb 32 gb 64 gb and 512 gb storage unit 1 bit is equals to 1 binary digit 8 bits is equals to 1 byte 1024 bytes is equal to 1 kb 1024 kb is equals to 1 mb 1024 mb is equals to 1 gb kb is equals to kilobyte MB is equals to megabyte. GB is equals to gigabyte. TB is equals to terabyte. New words: CD-ROM, compact disc read-only memory, DVD, digital video disc, CD, compact disc, memory recall. First. We use some storage devices to store our work. Second, a hard disk is the main storage device. Third, the full form of CD-ROM is compact disk read-only memory. Fourth, a CD-ROM is a circular disk. Fifth, pen drive is so small that it fits in our pocket. keychain etc